The NFL has decided not to suspend Tyreek Hill. Apparently, they don't have enough evidence to suspend him, so they're gonna let him play. I'm very surprised by this decision because Tyreek's arm, Tyreek's child's arm was broken. I'm not sure what happened there, but the child was eventually removed from both parents. So this is a very serious matter. I'm not quite sure how he got out of this. The thing is though, Tyreek Hill from here on out has to avoid putting himself in these situations. He's got to focus on taking care of his kid. He's got to focus on football and he has to make better choices. He's gonna have to just find a way to do it. This is not the first time that he's had issues with the law. So he's a repeat offender here. That alone I thought would get him suspended. But he's getting a second chance here and I hope he makes the most of it. He is such a dynamic, talented player. He's so explosive, he's so skilled. He's one of the big reasons why the Chiefs are so successful. I just hope that his career is not cut short because he cannot act right off of the field. It would be a travesty if his career were to end abruptly because he's constantly being suspended for abuse or anything else. So he's got to get his mind right, he's got to get his affairs in order, and he's got to just behave himself and act right. He shouldn't even put himself in a position where this could happen. So he's going to have to find a way to get along with his child's mother or he's going to have to find a way just to maybe seek counsel, get some professional help. That might be something that he should look into maybe, if, he if he's not doing it already. He should do that and he should just find a way to avoid these situations because in the long run, these things add up and it's going to hurt him. It's going to hurt his career. He's going to lose a lot of money. He's going to, you know, it's, gonna, it's really going to impact him in a way that is not good. So he's gotten a second chance with the NFL. I hope he makes the most of this opportunity. I really do. Because he's a very special player and he's on a great Chiefs team with him and Patrick Mahomes and Travis Kelsey. They can do great things this season and beyond. They have the players on their roster that are great enough to lead them to the Super Bowl. So they have enough talented players to go to the Super Bowl. They can beat the Patriots, it's possible. I wouldn't be surprised if the Chiefs made it to the Super Bowl this season coming up because they are very skilled, very gifted. They've got Andy Reid. He is an offensive mastermind. So the sky's the limit for the Chiefs. But the players, they've got to stay healthy and they've got to make good choices on and off the field. If they do that, they have a legitimate shot at making it to the Super Bowl and even winning the Super Bowl. They could win it all next season. It's very possible. So we we'll just have to wait and see what happens. And hopefully, great things will happen. Hopefully. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Please do me a big favor and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Just press that subscribe button below this video. If you did that, I would greatly appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. I hope that you have a blessed, wonderful day.